is our change of behavior. And my argument that maybe we are going through this change of behavior right now. Why would we call this a change of behavior? Because something happens differently now than in the previous instances where the price interacted with the resistance and 200 moving average. We're literally having one, two, three, four, five, six touches in this area where before we kind of had one, maybe two at the most, uh, you know, most uh, you know, close to that resistance. This in itself is a change of behavior. And then characteristically, we're seeing definitely there is lesser of the supply uh, relative to, let's say, previous areas where we've had increase of the supply. So that's why, Bruce, I'm thinking that maybe, you know, either we're going through here or alternatively, if we could have the reaction, let's say like even like this or even, you know, to the lower point of this trading range, I still think that the downtrend in line will catch up with all of this bullish activity and we're going to overcome this. So for now, we're still saying that the short-term trend is up just because of this bar and we're still in the upswing. Intermediate bias, we're considering this formation as our trading range formation. And then the long-term bias is just like, you know, secularly up. Uh, and if we have some kind of break to the upside right here, like this, and we go to the new target zone, which is this one right here, then we would switch the intermediate bias to uh, green regime again.